Okay, so um, I'm sure, you know, in your years, you've noticed people have a really hard time saying your last name. C-L-A-P-H-A-K-E. Clafake. 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 Clafake? Is it Clafake? Calfake? So, I would like you to spell your last name and say it out loud for everyone so they know how to say your last name. <laughs> Uh, my last name is spelled K-L-A-P-H-A-K-E and it's pronounced Klafake. I get Klafakes a lot. You get a lot of the PH being Fs. Um, some of the teachers here actually know it. I guess there's some Klafakes in this area, so some people know it, but I get a lot of Klafox, Klafakes, Klafakes, stuff like that. I have, I've heard a lot of stuff. So, um, Phil, where, where are you from? Um, I'm from Princeton, Minnesota. How long have you been playing football? <sighs> playing football since, um, since fifth grade. It was the first year that we had to organize football in my hometown. Did you start off playing QB? I was a wide receiver at first. Coach's kids were playing quarterback, actually. They, we, had, so we had some other good quarterbacks, too. Um, so I ended up playing wide receiver. And then when I came, actually, I moved to Princeton in seventh grade. That's when I started playing quarterback. So uh, going back to high school, you were a, a, a four-sport athlete. You played football, basketball, baseball, and track and field. So other than football, what, what's your next favorite sport to play? Whatever I was playing at the time. <laughs> Whatever I was playing at the time, it kind of depended. It always, I mean, throughout my, until about my junior year when I actually decided I want to play football, it would always change what I wanted to do, you know, during what season we were playing. So when you were choosing colleges, did, did you know for sure you wanted to go to a college to play football? At, at that point, when it started coming to that time of my career, you know, making that decision, it was, it was a football decision for me. So why, why did you choose SCSU? Um, I think a lot of it had to do with kind of my familiarity. Uh, being from Princeton, I'd come to camps here. I'd come to basketball, baseball, football camps here all the time. You know, got really comfortable with the campus, knew the coaches, um, came to some visits, watched a lot of games here. It just kind of felt really comfortable for me, really like home. And um, a lot of my family lives in this area, so it's really nice that they can come to all my games and, you know, watch me play. So now we're going to do a little quick answer segment. So I'm just going to ask you something and try and answer it as, as fast as you can. Don't try and think about it. Deal. Okay. Right. All right. Your favorite opponent? Mankato. Favorite road trip? Maine. Favorite arena, opponent arena to play in? Augustana. Favorite professional athlete? Probably Adrian Peterson right now. Favorite pro team? The Vikings. Favorite SCSU class? SCSU class? Whew. For, uh, probably my, my freshman comm class. Favorite thing to do besides play football? Just hanging out with friends, playing video games, hanging out with them, competing with my friends and having fun. Okay, favorite video game? And still play football, absolutely. Favorite TV show? Sports Center. <laughs> Favorite movie? Inception. Favorite website? Google. Favorite book? Nope. <laughs> Favorite band? I like all. I, mean, I like all music. I can't pick a specific band that I like the most. Favorite restaurant? Favorite restaurant? Applebee's. Favorite food? Favorite food. My mom's chili, absolutely. Deep pass over on the left side. Fred Williams is all alone. He comes down with it. And it's going to be an early touchdown, an early lead for St. Cloud State. Six to nothing at this point on the huge. So you're off to a pretty hot start this season. Um, what can you attribute to that? Um, well, I mean, we have so many weapons. We have, we have a lot of really good players. Our offensive line is very, very solid. A lot of good players there. Um, players like Fred Williams, a wide receiver, and Tyler Allery playing wide receiver, um, Dante, Chad, and you know Brandon Geis, even though he's hurt now playing running back. We, we have so many threats. It's pretty easy to be a good player on our team right now. Speaking of Fred Williams, um, you have a great chemistry with Fred, so talk a little bit about that. Well, me and Fred right now are roommates. Uh, we've been kind of hanging out all, you know, all this year, um, throwing a lot last year and coming into this year over the summer. So I know we've kind of developed a good friendship. Um, we both want to win, so we're pretty competitive, so that kind of helps us with that relationship that we have. What's your most memorable football moment? <sighs> right now, possibly beating Winona. Probably that moment. That was, that was pretty awesome. Um, you know, the first play against Augustana, we had a big play. That was a big moment. Uh -huh. Other than that, yeah, these, some of these college moments have been pretty big for me already. So, uh, looking to the future of your football career, what is your ultimate goal um, for your career in football at SCSU? Well, as a team, you know, I want to get us to the playoffs every year. Um, we want to be national championship contenders, and we feel like we've got talent to do that. Um, personally, I, I just, I just want to get our team there. I think that if I can get our team there, I'll be playing well enough and I'll be meeting my goals. If we can get to the playoffs and be a national championship contender, I'll be doing what I have to do.